In this economy, some people have had to forego their glasses of wine with dinner, which they really enjoy. But here is a way that you can drink your wine and save money, too. I'm Hovey Smith. I'm the host of a new radio show, The Backyard Sportsman, that will be broadcast on Voice America Radio on Friday mornings. And we will have cooking materials on our show. In this little section to follow, we'll talk about how you can save money drinking wine. I'm Hovey Smith, the host of a new radio show, The Backyard Sportsman. This year, we are having wines on the American market that are being actually sold at less than the cost of production. These are $4 wines. Even so, you can have additional savings if you dilute them in the fashion in which wines were originally drunk. In Roman and Greek times, wines were never drank literally what we would call out of a bottle. They were diluted with water first, and then they were consumed. So, that's exactly what we're going to do here. We'll take a little shot glass, and we'll pour some of the undiluted wine here. Then, we will make a dilution, as you see. of two to one, two parts water to one part wine. We have a very large wine glass, which is now being sold in Walmart. This is much larger than a traditional wine glass of any sort. A couple of ice cubes. And the result is a nice filling glass of watered wine, which tastes very good on a warm summer day. Now, if you want, you can serve that with a little shot glass of the original. So your guests can really enjoy what the wine was originally like. But this will quench thirst, and your wine consumption will be considerably extended and reduced. In my book, Backyard Deer Hunting, I have hunting instructions, recipes for wild game, and also tips on making tasty meals from wild game. So you will have food, recipes, cooking tips, cleaning instructions, and everything you need to go out and hunt and take some inexpensive meals from the outdoors. So, I'll see you later on the Backyard Sportsman.